Hey guys, so I'm going to do a video on Fitch versus Carefresh because quite a lot of people have asked, well, what's the difference between the two beddings? So I'm going to do like a video where I point out, say, like the price and then how good it controls odour and things like that with each of the different beddings. So, for price, Fitch is £7 for a 20 kilogram bag, which is massive. Um, that is if you can get it picked up from Staley Bridge. If you can't pick it up from Staley Bridge it is £15 with postage and that is still a really great price because the bags are massive. Um, whereas Carefresh is £6 for a, I think it's 10 litres, um, I could be wrong though. Let's just have a look. No, 14 litres. Um, they come in really weird sizes. So Carefresh Natural comes in 14 litres, 30 litres or 60 litres and the colours I think come in like 10 litres, um, 23 litres and 50 litres. So depending on which bag you get it will be dependent on how much you get in the bag with Carefresh. So for 14 litres you'll spend about £6 on a bag of Carefresh Natural. So as for controlling odour. I would say Fitch is brilliant. I've not cleaned the cages out for four weeks and I am not smelling anything from the cages at all. Obviously I spot clean as well but I've not cleaned like the bottom of their cages for four weeks and they do not even smell at all whereas if they were on Carefresh for four weeks they would have to be cleaned out by now because they would start to smell. Um, so I'm noticing a big difference in odour control between the two beddings. So both beddings look very similar to each other. Um, I really like Carefresh because you could get it in different colours, but I also really like Fitch um, because it is like really nice and soft, but you can't get it in different colours, unfortunately. It only comes in white. Also, you can only get Fitch in the UK, which is a bit of a downside for people who are in other countries, um, whereas if you're in another country, you can get Carefresh from quite a few places. So, as for dust, I believe that Carefresh can be quite dusty. Um, I've started to notice it a little bit um, with dust at the bottom of the cages, whereas with Fitch, I've not noticed any dust on the bottom of the cages. Usually if I use Carefresh, I have to go around and clean the cage after I've emptied the bedding. Using Fitch, um, I don't think I'll need to do that. I cleaned Humbug out last week. Um, and she did not have any dust at the bottom of her cage at all um, so I didn't even need to like wipe the bottom of the base down which I normally would have to do um, with Carefresh because it is quite dusty so I am noticing a big big difference between both beddings so Fitch is advertised for horses and also small animals whereas Carefresh is only advertised for small animals so both beddings are absorbent um, they are quite absorbent but I would say Fitch is definitely more absorbent than Carefresh um, Speedy's water bottle leaked and he was on Fitch at the time and there was no water at the bottom of his cage whatsoever the bedding mopped the water up really really well and you could barely even tell that his water bottle had leaked in his cage because of the bedding just did such a good job of absorbing all the water whereas with Carefresh I've had water bottles leak in the past and the cage just looks like it's been drowned and um, with Carefresh I find that it doesn't really absorb as much as what Fitch bedding does so in all honesty I can really really recommend Fitch bedding. Fitch is a lot softer than Carefresh. Um, I tend to find Carefresh is sort of like kind of hard um, comparing to the Fitch. So until I actually found out about Fitch I thought oh yeah Carefresh is actually quite soft but it's not. Fitch is so much softer than Carefresh. Um, so Carefresh is quite hard comparing to it. Um, the hamsters prefer Fitch. All of them 
are literally sleeping in the bottom of the cages, curled up in their fitch, whereas when I was using Carefresh, they used to sleep in their nests. Um, but now they'll just flop out anywhere in their cage and I'll just quite happily go to sleep, which is telling me that the hamsters really enjoy sleeping within the fitch bedding. They also sometimes drag it into their corner of the cage and they'll make like a full on nest out of this. I don't even need to give them nesting material anymore, um, whereas with Carefresh I would still need to give them nesting material because the hamsters don't like sleeping in it for some reason. Um, so yeah, that is just like a super quick video on Carefresh versus Fitch. I can honestly recommend Fitch. Um, the people who sell it are really really nice and if you could go pick it up from Staley Bridge it is definitely worth getting at least two bags um, because then you don't have to keep travelling to and from. So the only downside with Fitch is that you need somewhere to store the bags. So my bags, you've probably seen them in one of my videos but they are stored down the side of my wardrobe because they are just that big. Um, you do need like a shed or somewhere in your room to store them otherwise you will kind of be stuck with a bag of hamster bedding just in the middle of your bedroom where you can't move um, so I suppose if you don't have the storage space then Carefresh is probably better for you because Carefresh comes in like smaller bags so um, yeah if you use Fitch or Carefresh let me know what you guys think right down below in the uh, I was going to say description, um, let me know what you guys think in the comments because um, I know a lot of people who have switched from Carefresh to Fitch and they've also told me that they would never ever switch back to Carefresh after they've tried Fitch because Fitch is just so much better and it's so much more value for money um, so yeah let me know what you guys think down below if you have used both of the beddings um, so I hope this video helped if you are thinking about trying Fitch or possibly even Carefresh um, so it's just a cheap alternative really and I can promise you your hamster, rabbit, guinea pig will love fitch bedding. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe. Bye.